Okay, so for lunch, my dad got us Sabaro's Pizza. Yes, Peter Piper, Papa John's, Dumb Nose. Uh, Pizza Hut is good, but nothing in my opinion is better than Sabaro's except for actual new, uh, pizza from New York City. So this is probably the closest we can get to that. So there's the cheese, which is my favorite. I just like cheese. And then my parents, pepperoni. So, yeah. And then of course, to go with that, the Mexican Coke. Funniest thing, whenever I'm walking through the hallway or anywhere, Sassy is always following me right behind me. Literally, every time I get up, she follows me. Ready to continue editing video, Sassy? I know Sassy, but yesterday we decided to sleep too long, so now we gotta go back to editing. Sassy, just because you're laying on the computer does not is not gonna stop me from editing videos. I uploaded Tyler's newest video, which is a Topps 2013-2014 football card pack break. If you guys enjoy collecting, uh, Football cards, go check it out. And also, if you haven't already, go check out our Warhead Challenge that we did on his channel also. Oh yeah, and I forgot to mention. Head over to Jellybean13 Tyler's channel, who's my nephew. It's Jellybean13, just like that. And make sure you hit the subscribe button. Help him get to 300. I'm about to finish uploading... Uh, February 22nd vlog. Me and Sassy are so exhausted. We literally started editing at 1 o'clock and it's 3 o'clock now and we're not even close to being done. I also edited another vlog that will be up later on tonight and it's called My Brother Ate a Booger. So if you want to see what that's all about, go check out that vlog. It's hilarious. I love it. It features me, my mom, uh, my brother and his girlfriend, Teresa. So, you can just imagine what that vlog is about. And now I'm currently working on another vlog. Now you guys are probably wondering, why are you working on so many vlogs? Well guys, I fell extremely behind. And I plan on catching up today. So, I really hope I do guys. Like I said, I started editing at 1 o'clock. And it is 4.32. I've been out this for 3.5 hours already. So I'm almost finished and it'll feel it's gonna feel great to be caught up. We finally finished editing. Sassy is pooped and she is ready to take a nap. I have finally caught up with my video editing. It only took nearly four hours today, along with like three hours yesterday. But I am done. Finally. Literally, it feels so good to be done. I don't have to worry about it. I can just relax the rest of the day and do whatever I want. Alright guys, so today is Thursday. So that means Friday, well excuse me, that's not Friday Night Smackdown anymore. It's Thursday Night Smackdown. So it just started right now. We have uh, the League of Nations versus um, Neville. And the Lucha Dragons and the guy I hate the most, Dolph Ziggler. So I love the Lucha Dragons. Neville's okay. I hate Ziggler, but uh, I'm gonna be going for the Lucha Dragons. Who are you going for, my? The Lucha Dragons. They are very good. So even though we don't like Dolph Ziggler, we're still going for that team, just because of the Lucha Dragons. It's honestly time for Jerry the King Lawler to retire. And no, Seamus, we are not entertained. All right, well, the League of Nations won, so we'll see you guys back uh, on the next match. I don't know what it'll be yet, but when they announce it, me and my mom will give you our uh, predictions. All right, well, the next match uh, ended so fast that I wasn't even able to get uh, my camera ready, but it was the Dudleys versus the Usos. Honestly, I was going for the Usos. Who are you going for, Mai? I was going for the Dudleys, even though I don't like them. Uh, and the Dudleys ended up winning. Oh, Shane McMahon's gonna be on SmackDown. If you guys don't know this, I love Shane McMahon. He's always been my favorite uh, McMahon ever since I was little. 
and I never thought he would come back. I would always talk about how I wanted him to come back, but I never thought it would happen. And I would always tell my brother how much I wanted him to come back. And when he came back, I was shocked. And the fact that I'm going to be seeing him wrestle at WrestleMania is awesome because I've never seen him... Uh, I've actually never seen Shane McMahon live. And I've never seen him wrestle live, like in person. I've seen him on TV and wrestle on TV and stuff, but... I've never actually like been there when he was wrestling or even just showing up to the show. So I'm really looking forward to that for WrestleMania. Especially in a Hell in a Cell match, considering all the cool stuff and uh, crazy stuff Shaving Man used to do. So we'll see you guys uh, for the next match. Alright guys, so the next match is going to be Big Show versus Kevin Owens. So um, I'm going to be going for Kevin Owens. Who are you going to be going for, Mike? Kevin Owens, I like him. So we both like Kevin Owens, we think he's hilarious. But just a fun fact for this vlog, as you guys know, every year I go to WrestleMania. I went to WrestleMania 26, I went to WrestleMania 26 in, my, in uh, Phoenix, WrestleMania 28 in Miami, WrestleMania 30 in New Orleans, and I went to WrestleMania 31 last year in San Jose slash San Francisco, and I will be going this year in um, Dallas, and I will more than likely be going next year, and so on and so forth. So. The fun fact for this vlog, since it's going to be the Big Show versus Kevin Owens, is that last year in San Francisco, uh, while, I was at, as, while I was at WrestleMania Access, my parents decided to uh, go eat breakfast after they dropped us off at the convention center. So while they were sitting there, they just kind of, did you, did you guys just kind of look over and you guys saw him, right? Yes. All right, well, yeah, they were just sitting there, and they looked over and saw a very huge man. And as you guys can probably guess, who I just said is in the match right now, is more than likely the person they saw, is the Big Show. So my dad did go and take a picture with the Big Show. Is the, is the picture on here? All right, well, we couldn't find the picture with my dad and Big Show. I honestly don't know where it went, but... That picture you did see, uh, my mom took a picture of Big Show, as you saw, and sent it to me while I was at Access. And it's irritating because the one figure I need signed is my three-pack with John Cena, Edge, and Big Show. It is already signed by John Cena and Edge, but like I can't find I can't find a meet and greet with Big Show. I've met the Big Show before um, when I when I was like uh, like a seventh grader or six. Uh, eighth grader I don't remember but um I'm trying to think yeah probably like an eighth grader so I have met him but I just didn't have that figure at the time so I really hope I can get that figure signed eventually but right now big shows uh kicking Kevin Owens butt so not looking too good for Kevin Owens but wait 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 oh, okay well there's a reversal Kevin Owens got big show Okay, well, nope, that failed. Let's see. I cannot imagine picking up the Big Show. It's just like... His whole hand could fit over my hand and my arm, practically. Alright, well, I'm pretty sure that didn't feel too good for the Big Show. Big Show got hit in the no-nos, so... We'll see you guys after the match ends. All right, Kevin Owens wins by countout because uh, when Big Show got uh, hit in the little Big Show, um, <laughs> I don't know why I thought that, I found that funny. Um, he got counted out. So yeah, we'll see you guys on the next match. All right, so the next match is gonna be Natalia versus Becky Lynch. Now I really like both of them, but one wrestler that I've always liked was Natalia. Ever since she was in ECW with uh, the heart, uh, with uh, the Heart Dynasty, with uh, her husband Tyson Kidd, and um, I can't remember his name, um, the British Bulldog son. But yeah, so my who are you going for, Becky Lynch or Natalia? Becky Lynch, Natalia. I don't really like her too much. She was nice when we met her, though. She's a very nice person, but I just don't like her. She's very nice. Uh, that's another fun fact for this video, I guess. Uh, if you guys don't know, I did meet Natalia at WrestleMania. And her father. And her father. Well, it, it was actually the second time I had, I had met her father. But the first time meeting Natalia, I actually 
had a chance at WrestleMania Mania 30 to meet Natalia, but they closed the line, which sucks. And you guys are probably wondering, how do you get to meet all these wrestlers? Well, like, I know when you go to WrestleMania, you do get to meet a lot of wrestlers, but at Access, to be honest, you can only meet one or two wrestlers if you're in the regular lines. But since I have cancer and I get to go in the disabled line, I get to meet pretty much everybody that shows up to Access. Because I literally, I only waited about three minutes in the Bella's line, right? Yes. And everyone else waited about two hours. So, I guess dealing with this stuff has its advantages. Alright, so Natalia won by disqualification. And of course, Charlotte has to come out and open her big old mouth. Oh, I'm so sick of Charlotte. And this Monday, we're going to find out who's facing Charlotte at WrestleMania. Sasha Banks or Becky Lynch. Who do you guys think is going to win that match? If you guys watch WWE, who do you think is going to win? Sasha Banks or Charlotte? Who do you think, Mai? I think Charlotte. I mean, excuse me. No, my Sorry, I said this wrong. Who do you think is going to win the number one contender match to face Charlotte at WrestleMania? Sasha Banks or Becky Lynch? Oh, I think uh, Becky Lynch. Becky Lynch also because it's gonna be like against the best friends, but at the same time it could be uh, Sasha Banks because did I say that right? Yes. Okay. Yeah, Sasha Banks because I think Charlotte and Sasha Banks used to be like best friends in NXT So it could go either way, but I honestly think it's gonna be Sasha Banks because of her popularity All right guys, so the next match is the New Day versus AJ Styles Chris Jericho and Mark Henry so I'm going for uh, two of my favorites, AJ Styles and uh, Chris Jericho. Who are you going for, My AJ Styles team. Yeah. And they're going to win. So if you guys don't know, I actually do really like Chris Jericho. And I have been an AJ Styles fan since his days in TNA. So, yeah. All right, guys. So I forgot to record the end of SmackDown. Do you know who won my Chris Jericho's team or New Day? No. Honestly, we completely forgot, but if I had to guess, it would be AJ Styles and Chris Jericho's team. But, uh, yeah, so right now we're watching the Golden Girls, and then we'll see you guys in a while. Uploading the second vlog of the day. Alright guys, so that's the end of this vlog. Make sure you go check out all my social media, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Wrestling Amino, um, Kick, and Snapchat. Um, also, if you haven't already, go check out Tyler, who is my nephew, his uh, YouTube channel, he is Jellybean13. And if you guys want to send me or anyone in my family any kind of, uh, uh, I was going to say, um, if you guys want to send me or my family any kind of fan mail, my P.O. box is down below, and it will be opened on my Miss WWE Fan 13 channel. So if you want to send me something, my mom something, my brother, uh, Tyler, uh, my sister, my brother-in-law, whoever. Um, and if you guys want something signed and returned to you, make sure you uh, put a self-addressed stamped envelope inside of the letter you sent to us so we can send it back to you guys. And uh, other than that, guys, that's really it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog for today. It's just a little short. I'm just still not feeling very well. And uh, I have a lot of videos planned for my Miss WWE Fan 13 channel. A lot of collective, uh, collection videos, so also stay tuned for that. And if there's any other kind of videos you want me to do, either for this channel or my Miss WWE Fan 13 channel, just comment on down below. So we'll see you guys tomorrow in the next vlog.